Hey guys, so today I'm going to teach you how to unlock all the Lux items in Descenders as of 2023. So I hope you enjoy this video. Sit back, grab some popcorn, and let's get into this. So as you guys can see here, I'm just going through all the Lux items. You can see I have four bikes. Um, I have two helmets. I don't have any goggles from the Lux set yet, but I do also have four shirts, and you can't see it yet, but I do have four pants. I also forgot to say I also had the blue and green Lux reflectors. Sorry, back to the video. So before I get into the strategy on how to unlock these Lux items, you first need to know that you need to have Career Plus unlocked. This means that you need to have, in total, 100,000 rep. Uh, a way to check this is to load into the game, obviously. Make sure you're in the main lobby with the uh, big statue. Look down into the middle of your screen, and if you see a number that is 100,000 or higher, you should know that um, you have unlocked Career Plus. Another way to uh, know if you have Career Plus unlocked is to click the Options menu, click um whatever it is you need to to get to where you can do actual runs uh, from like highlands to peaks desert to glaciers um if you see that the career plus is unlocked go ahead and click on that and you need to go into the desert map like you see here once you're in the desert uh like you see here you need to spam tricks and make sure you're not uh, doing the same trick every time as it will give you less rep for that trick every time you do it So as you see here, I'm trying not to do the same trick every time But you want to keep spamming these tricks and spamming these tricks until you get to the very end of um, Your little node right once you get to the end you'll see that I have around 10,000 once you have 10,000 you are going to go through here and You know get your perks and you see here that I get fakie balance um so now you'll see me ride backwards only go through the first checkpoint and go backwards this will give you a bunch of rep off one node and keep in mind this is on a uh one two and three steepness node so i believe this one is a two steepness node you can watch the footage back whatever you want just stay in between one two and three steepness as four will be a little dangerous if you're just starting out uh, and if you don't have, uh, like the speed wobble thing, I definitely don't recommend it. I apologize if you did not see, but this is a three steepness node, meaning I'm about to get a bunch of rep off of this by only going through the first checkpoints and doing this node multiple times. Um, it's pretty fair and it's pretty simple. It's not hard to learn. Do it a couple times. You should be good. But, um... If you look here, I just keep going, keep going. The only time you should be jumping is if you need a bunch of speed and you're on like a one steepness node. Um, if you're on a one steepness, only do it like one time. And I want to point out that once you um, do this multiple times and you only start getting like 8,000 to 6,000 rep on your runs, you need to stop and go to the next node. Um, you're just basically getting no rep now, and, uh, it's not fun, it's tedious to do, kind of, if you're going for, like, a 100,000, and going for a 100,000 isn't necessarily bad, you have a better chance at getting a Lux item, personally, it's just faster if you go, um, through a 50,000 rep run, it's just way easier, it's way faster, and it doesn't take up much of your time, now, with this being said, uh, once you get to the end of your run and you get towards 50k, you'll see me turn around, collect my rep, and you're going to pause and end your session. Uh, just You can go ahead and skip through all the stuff. In this run, I did not get a Lux item, but that is okay. Um, just try to go for all the items, honestly. But yeah, that'll do it for this video. I uh, hope this helped you. And this is kind of like an add-on to like my how to get the rainbow Lux bike. Um, anyways, hope y'all enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.